What's going on everybody? Here I am on my early 2015 13-inch Retina MacBook Pro. What we're going to be doing here is we're going to update from Mac OS Sierra to High Sierra. It recently came out on September 25th of this year. But uh, to get the uh, Mac OS High Sierra upgrade we're going to go directly to the App Store. And what we're going to be doing here is we're going to make an attempt to upgrade our, I mean, upgrade my MacBook Pro to High Sierra. Since High Sierra had just recently came out. I'm gonna also showcase some of the features, but uh, in a different video. But we're gonna go ahead and download it, and we're gonna also install it. So it's gonna take a while. So let me go ahead and um, get going before you actually install, upgrade to Mac OS High Sierra. You make sure you want to back up your, or make sure you back up your hard drive so you don't lose any data, or if you're having problems with High Sierra, you can definitely use your old backup to go back to Sierra. So we're using right now. We're going to be upgrading to Mac OS 10.13. From 10.12, so I'll be right back up once we make some progress. All right, we're back. I got the installer for Mac OS High Sierra up since we're gonna upgrade from Mac OS Sierra to High Sierra, but uh, this will be a big improvement, hopefully. So let's go ahead and click continue. The most important thing is to check your license agreement and uh, be sure to read it carefully. But I've already read it before, so not many people, some people don't hardly read it anyway, but let's go ahead and click agree. And we're gonna make sure to have it installed on Macintosh HD. If you have a different partition for, let's say if you got built, doing a multi-boot with Windows, you don't want to put it on your Windows partition, but uh, because they use a different file system. And the only reason why you probably have a Windows partition is if you're using Boot Camp. But um, since I'm not using Boot Camp at all, we're gonna go ahead and use. A default storage on here so we're gonna go ahead and click install and let me go ahead and get plugged into a power source and begin the installation We're going to enter our admin password. So, so let me go ahead and stop the recording. Be right back. All right, we're back. I did the Mac OS Sierra upgrade. Yes, I got it pulled up right here, but uh, and the reason I got it at the bottom like this because I don't want to show the serial number, but uh, but at any rate, it took a while because of my crappy internet connection because I was using a 
crappy DSL connection, but uh, one thing about upgrading your computer to High Sierra, you want to make sure all your programs are compatible and up to date before installing High Sierra. And I don't, and I recommend not to back it up yet until you're more familiar with the operating system, but um. Because High Sierra just recently came out, but uh, you want to make sure everything's fully compatible with High Sierra. And I wouldn't really recommend backing up yet. Because I know there was a exploit going around for third party programs. So all my apps are up to date, but everything works just fine. And I'm going to go ahead and end this video. And, and you want to make sure all your iCloud settings are configured the way you have them before. So I'm going to go ahead and, like I said, cut this video short. It's just a little upgrading from macOS Sierra to high Sierra. And thanks for watching.